Valera versus Valera. Why are there so many rogues suddenly? What the hell? Are we going second at least? That's good. Pillager? Never pillager. Probably shouldn't have kept two backstabs. It was pretty greedy too. Whatever. I'm gonna cycle the fan next turn. This hand is only spells. I've drawn into a hand entirely of spells. <laughs> Why? We don't even have preps, like we have so many spells, but... Um... Out of backstabs, feels bad. <sighs> Need auctioneer, otherwise we're in really bad shape. Really, really bad shape. That's scary. I can't take that damage to face or I lose the game. Drake Sap. Sap. Auctioneer or uh, Emperor coin into Eviscerate as a play. Actually, maybe just Teacher Eviscerate. Ugh, I hate when you like just don't draw into any cycle or anything as rogue. You just kind of like feel helpless a lot of times. It's the only issue I have, but this deck should have enough cycle. It's just uh, every now and then you feel a little, a little lost, you know? A little lost. His hand's really full, surprisingly. He has seven cards in hands. Prep sprint. Yeah. Nothing matters. Not even Hearthstone, man. What has my life become? Nothing really matters. Second prep? Wow. Okay. Well, he's at uh, eight cards and we're at like none. <laughs> Feels bad. I need to cycle this Thalmos. I'm gonna go double pillager here. I might be dead. If he has oil or something. It's a lot of backstabs. It would be a shame if someone were to flurry this board down. Oil as well. Oil. Alright, we're rich. We got all the coins. We just need an auctioneer. Got this. Oh, doggy. Alright, so here's a BGH in hands. We have Healbot somewhere left in our deck. Uh, we have the Farseer and Beltry to stall, but we'll see. I don't know. I'd say I'm a, a pretty happy person. But, uh, 
I understand the feels sometimes. Should see a sap here. Need to heal so badly. I'm probably just gonna go Beltry, Farseer, Thalnos here. Could go with the Emperor, try to set up something, but we don't even have Malagos, so it's irrelevant. Go with Deadly if he doesn't kill this. That's gonna be a Deadly. And hope to draw into a heal button here. Malagos isn't lethal. Uh, I know he has a sap in his deck. If I heal up, we are at 9 HP. I can attack in and flurry. I guess we go with a Belcher here. Attack in and flurry only gives me one draw. At that point, I have a 1 in 5 to draw into a heal, so this is better. He has a sap in hand for sure. I kind of expect to die. Found this flurry eviscerate. Yeah, I'll take the this. That's fine. Flurry. Oh, double this. He didn't have the flurry. Oh. Uh, I have a Harrison in place of the Ysera. I just took it out. We have the two most important cards in the Control Warrior Mirror. So that's good. I love Control Warrior. That's the attitude. Control Warrior is the best. How can you think Control Warrior is boring? So many decisions to be made. Like press this button or, or press this button. It's Patron? I don't know, man. Might be Reno. Weird. I like Beltry because if he has Death Bite, he attacks in here, then he plays the uh, Death Bite, kills this first half, and then this attacks into the slime. This is at uh, 5 HP and I can kill it with my Death Bite and this dies also because it's at 1 HP because it trades in first. Looks like he's going to slam. That's fine as well. Slam Bash. Still, if he, attack if he attacks like this, the slime cleans up most of it. I don't really care about the uh, Armor Smith, so I'm just going to go like this. Play this guy. Easy game, easy life. Too much rage today. I need to calm down. Some nice resident sleeper warrior. Relax a little bit. Nice and relaxing control warrior. God, who doesn't love control warrior nowadays? Get back. I, got the beast in my I was considering going revenge to deal with this, but that's okay. It's fine. Slightly irritating. I could just sit. I guess I sit. Maybe I'll need the execute. Maybe he'll play a threat like Eosera and I'll need to go revenge execute Despite. So I get a little more value from this. I'm technically taking zero damage a turn because of my hero power. He's gaining two armor a turn. There's the Eosera I was talking about. So now the revenge will actually get value because I need to use it for the execute, which is nice. It's also a reason why I didn't execute the boom because he's a dragon warrior. I need an answer for you, Sarah. Otherwise, I lose the game. I just want to cycle. Why not? I see no harm in it. We're out of dust bites, the only problem. 
He's already played a lot of threats. Um, what's the usual distribution with streaming slash monthly salary, say, for a small to mid-sized organization? Um, really? So I hope you could enjoy the song. I did. Thank you. I really did uh, appreciate it. It's right here. Might be a brawl. Yeah, why not? I don't want him to get more card draw. And if any of the other two live, it's fine. Yeah, so like, that's fine. I guess I attack him. Alright, so the question was... What is the usual distribution with streaming slash monthly salary, say for a small to mid-sized organization? You talked about the importance of streaming. Does the orgy typically take streaming money? The organization never takes streaming money. Organization is mostly there to provide uh, travel or monetary gains for the uh, streamer or for the um, person they're employing or, you know, contracting, I guess. Uh, I, I guess there might be an organization that takes streaming money. I have not heard of it. I don't know how much I'm able to talk about it, but it's just, I don't know. Yeah, Orgy doesn't really take money. Uh, the usual distribution for a mid-sized organization. I don't know what you mean by mid-sized organization. It uh, really depends on like, how big they are. I really have no idea. Deal with this next turn. Uh, organizations can take uh, tournament money depending on what kind of contract you have. Uh, that's a really common thing with uh, team esports that provide a large uh, prize pool. And it costs a lot for the organization to fly teams out. For instance, uh, I'm sure Dota 2, owners of Dota 2 teams. Owners of Dota 2 teams? That was such a weird play. Um. I'm sure Dota 2 teams or organizations take money, almost all of them, uh, from what I know. I'm not actually sure if all of them do, but I've heard that they do because, like, I don't know, if they take, like, 10% of the prize money from the team, that's not that much. Especially if you win, like, a $200,000 tournament, that's, like, what, 20k? That usually just covers, like, flights and hotels, maybe, for certain tournaments. So, yeah. But uh, for Hearthstone, usually... I mean, they can take prize money. It really just depends, I guess. I can brawl this if I want. That thing is hurting me like crazy. <sighs> We're out of revenges. We have a weapon, maybe? Shield block. Could play monkey. It's a terrible idea, though. Let's do this. I want to kill this, but I can't because I have nothing. He has no more threats left either. But like, this is annoying because I want this to die. There we go, we have an answer to it, thank God. I might even just get rid of this Gromash. Just Bash. I guess Bash is acceptable here. Yeah, let's just play Monkey. I don't care at this point. I play Ysera. I think I'm gonna play Gruul because I have an answer to a BGH with um He's ahead on cards, but we're gonna win the fatigue battle. Could have gone with Trade Prince. Meh. I don't want to give him coins because he's gonna give me worthless spells and he's gonna get coins. I guess that's the same as him just not playing the spells. Yeah, I don't know. Hemet? You guys don't like Hemet? Hemet's beautiful. Look at this stallion. Man, he's got the fire roaring and everything. I like having the golden at least because I get to see all the golden legendaries that I wouldn't be able to afford because I'm a pleb. It's nice. It's a nice feeling, you know. I'm not going to commit anymore. He might have a brawl. He hasn't played one yet. I assume he has one. This guy is a big boy. Holy shoot. That's a big boy also. So the second he drops the monkey, we go with the Sarah. We have two, three more legendaries. Right. BGH. I've got the beast in okay. 
Uh, Trade Prince seems better. Juggernaut. Juggernaut's bad, because we need to wait for him to play Elise. Because <laughs> we're just giving him a card if we do that. I don't really want to do that. So, Where's my cut? Where's his map to the monkey? <gasps> he gave me a map to the monkey! I can get another monkey! Dope. Oh, he drew it immediately. That bug is cool. Makes everything look so dope. Uh, so we can get rid of these garbage legendaries. Let's play Why? Okay, I don't- I don't want that many- like, it just gives him cards if he gets the monkey. It's not worth it. I think I play Mimrons, or... I definitely don't play the Juggernaut. I think I either armor or I... I think I just armor. We gotta be conservative here. We got another golden monkey. He's gonna play his monkey right now. We're gonna drop Ysera, and Ysera's gonna give us all this great shit, and then we're gonna convert it all again, because we have a monkey. We have a map. Got the map to the monkey. <laughs> That's the monkey, because I knew he drew it last turn. That card right there is the monkey. Because of the bug. And there's the monkey. I might actually go Sonaria's buff. Uh, let's just go with Ysera. Sarah. We'll see if he gets any good legendaries to play. Ysera is so good. Ugh, Craigasm. Craigasm, Ysera. Our last card is Golden Monkey as well. Ooh, Stalag. Actually, maybe I do go buff. I think buff is better. What else am I supposed to do in this situation? Yeah. Well, I could go with the, the two twos, right? But then if he has Geddon, I get punished really hard. Seven, six. Kills my Ysera. Sonari's buff seems like the best. Monkey's a beast? No, it's not. It's a statue! It looks like a freaking statue on it! How is that a beast? Oh my god. Come on, guys. Come on. Use your noggins. Seems like the best. So we'll play Ysera, and we'll get some dream cards, and then we can convert those dream cards. Holy shit, that's really good for him. He can kill it. Shh. Shh. Don't let him know. Don't let him know, boys. This card actually is pretty good against him. 10 damage is a good amount. I might play this prior to the monkey. Ah, mm -hmm. oh, Leroy Dankins. Come on, man. I don't even think I want you, Sarah Awakens, at this point. It depends what he plays, obviously. Yeah, I don't think I want you, Sarah Wakens. I'll just convert this into a legendary. We'll go trade, trade, trade. Play um, Iron Juggernaut and then Monkey. That makes some sense. Take your mind, punk. God damn, those are bad legendaries. These are so bad. <laughs> you lost! We won! That was pretty anticlimactic. That's okay.